Why me? Good morning, Ephrata. I'm Sam. And I'm Gerald. And today is Tuesday, October 31st. Happy Halloween. Halloween. <laughs> Please rise, remember the signs, and a pledge to the flag. Tomorrow, a representative from the Navy will be here at 9 o'clock. Any students interested in meeting with this representative in the CRC, please see Mrs. Ditzler in the guidance office. There will be a meeting of the Tri-Am Music Honor Society on Wednesday morning at 7.15 in the auditorium. Attention all students! Picture retake day is today, October 31st. If you miss picture day at the start of the school year or you are new to Ephraim and need your photo ID, please. Stop by the auditorium on Tuesday, October 31st. If you had your picture taken and need it retaken, please bring your jacket, please bring your packet to you, the auditorium, to give to the photographer. On Monday, November 6th, Conestoga Valley High School will be hosting their 44th annual college night from 6 to 8 p.m. There will be over 200 colleges, trade, nursing, technical, and business schools represented. In addition to the schools, there will also be seminars on how to choose a college and financial aid. This event is perfect for freshmen, sophomores, and juniors as it's never too early to start planning. Information booklets are available now in the counseling office. Be sure to tell your parents and add this event to your calendar. November 6th, the CV College Fair. If you have any questions, see your counselor ASAP. <laughs> and now over to name the news. Today in the news, according to a statement by President Donald Trump, an integral coordinator of the 2012 attack on the U.S. Uh, cons okay, that's cut off. <laughs> Consulate in Benghazi, Libya, was captured yesterday. The man, Mustafa Ali Man, now awaits trial in the U.S. Although it is unknown exactly what kind of sentence awaits him, Donald Trump stated that the terrorist will face justice in the, uni in the United States. According to news reports, approximately 126 million Americans viewed content of Russian origin containing questionably to blatantly false information during the election cycle. Facebook creator Mark Zuckerberg initially called the idea that fake news on a social media network might have influenced the 2016 election is a pretty crazy idea, but is now looking into fighting the Russian propagated misinformation campaign. A district judge has blocked Trump's presidential memo bearing tra transgender people from serving the armed forces. The decision was based on the idea that the ban did not at all keep the interests of the military in mind, but instead was engineered with no other purpose than to target transgender citizens. We've got some creepy historical events for you today. In 1892, Arthur Conan Doyle published his first collection of Sherlock Holmes stories. Of course, Sherlock Holmes is now a household name because of the excellent BBC adaption with Benedict Cumberbatch. So celebrate by going home and watching Hounds of the Bas Baskervilles and get spooky. Also, Harry Houdini spookily died on Halloween in 1926. He was known for his amazing escape tricks and also for having abs of steel. When one man punched him in the gut before he was ready, he died with a ruptured appendix in a fever of 104 degrees. Yikes. And for all the AP, Euro, and World History students out there, today marks the day that Martin Luther unveiled his 95 Thesis, effectively showcasing everything he hated about the Catholic Church. What's scarier than having to learn about the Protestant Reformation? Okay, maybe a lot of other things. Now over to Seth and Braden with... Okay. <laughs> Today for lunch, I have Brayden here, and we have walking tacos with Spanish rice, mozzarella stuffed sticks with sauce, Papa John's pizza, mm -mm. ham, roast beef, and cheese wrap, fruit and yogurt parfait with a muffin, mm, buffalo chicken salad, refried beans, oh yeah, Mexican corn, mm, grape tomatoes, including dip. That's a steal. A sort of fresh fruit or that wonderful, what is it, Brayden? Slushy. Slushy!
please come out and support the boys soccer team tonight for the District 3 semifinal match versus Cumberland Valley at Hershey Park Stadium. The game begins at 7.30. Parking is free. Admission is $4 for students and $6 for adults. Go Mounts! The Junior vs. Senior Powder Puff game is Wednesday, November 8th starting at 7 p.m. at the War. Remember to come on out and cheer on your Lady Mounts. The rifle team will be holding two open gyms before the season starts. Anyone interested, please meet the coach by the high school main entrance on November 2nd and 9th at 6 p.m. If you have any questions, please see Mrs. Cummings in the athletic office. Attention all dodgeball captains. There is a mandatory captains meeting on Wednesday, November 1st after school in room 129 from 2.40 to 3 o'clock. Someone from your team must attend this meeting. Rules will be reviewed and pools will be chosen. Once again, that meeting is Wednesday, November 1st in room 129 from 2.40 to 3 and you must have a representative from your team there. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Geyer in room 129. Now back to the main desk. Hey, Row Row Robot Club members. Want to hear something really scary? Something really frightening? Something that will make you shake in your shoes? Our first competition is only two months away. We've got a lot, I mean a lot, to do in the next eight weeks, so do not miss tomorrow's meeting. Mr. Myers is on a field trip, but don't let that fool you into thinking that we won't have our meeting. If he isn't in the room right after school, he'll be there shortly, so just sit in the hall and chill. Or better yet, go to Dairy Queen and chill. And be back by the room, 3.20 at 3 o'clock. Row, row, robots club. Yeah. STEM Sisters is hosting another free event on November 16th from 5 to 8. You can get your hands on a cardiac son sonography, engineering, and radiologic tech labs at Hacks Lancaster Campus. Dinner is provided, but you must register. See Mrs. Hall to register or go to the North Museum's website. The school counseling office is holding a contest to look for artwork to feature on the cover of the 2018-2019 course selection guidebook. If you are interested, please download a copy of the information sheet that has been posted in your school news feed. The submission deadline is November 22nd, so do not delay. That's it for us here, Ephrata. Have a spooky Happy Halloween! Halloween. some questions. Let's go. Well, what what is your favorite Halloween movie? This, this, this guy's a noob. All right, you know we're already here with John Conroy. Here we go. Good. All right, John, I got a question for you. What is your favorite Halloween movie? <laughs> Uh, Nightmare on Elm Street. Solid. Hey, there we are with one of the soccer team captains, Mr. AJ Morales. What is your favorite Halloween movie? Oh, probably Halloween Town. That's a classic. Classic man. Oh, 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 oh. Alright, well, you know we're here with him. Alright, he's got a Duke hoodie on, represent. What is your favorite Halloween movie? My favorite Halloween movie! You so Nice. And now we're here with Paul Louie and the Schwann. Paul Louie, what is your favorite Halloween movie? Stranger Things Season 1 and Season 2. Coming out Friday. Binge watch it with the one, the only, Mr. Billy Bean. Billy Bean, what is your favorite Halloween movie? Halloween movie? Halloween Town. You gotta go to class. All the time. All the time, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, her eyes, her eyes make the stars look like they're not shining. Her hair, her hair. Without her trying, she's so beautiful. Here we are with uh, June Riddle, one of the uh, one of the guys on the Dam with us. Jonah, what is your favorite Halloween movie? Favorite Halloween movie? Um, hmm. I actually don't know. He doesn't know. That is impressive. Thank you, sir. Here we are with Trey Farlow. Trey, what is your favorite Halloween or horror movie? I like uh, I Am Legend. I thought that was pretty good. Solid answer from a solid man. Here we go. Here's Evan. Sir, sir, let me ask you a question. Sir, can we ask you a question? Oh, sir. No, 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 I didn't send immediately. No, no, I can't, can't do it. Noah, what is your favorite Halloween or horror movie? Teletubbies, for sure. They are, uh, they are pretty scary. Yes, indeed. The talk. Just, you just want some love. Even skate. What, what, no, no, get off the mic. Walk away. Slowly. 